Thank you. Thank you, everyone. So, welcome. Welcome, everybody, to the invitation on Hamel Hustings. My name is uh, Madhura Rasratham. I'm with um, the in my Hamel capacity or in Hamel space. I'm the interim executive director of the organization for Pearl. Um, and in my day job, I'm an academic. I'm an associate professor of comparative politics at City University. And I'm really delighted to be here today to open this event. Uh, first of all, I want to really thank our speakers for taking the time, and I'm sure it's a very, very busy schedule to come and speak to us today. So to Andrew Mitchell, um, to Catherine West, and to Bilali and Dash from the Green Party as well, we're really grateful for you to take, for taking the time. So the purpose of this event is to really foreground um, the Tamil issues and to put it on, to keep it on the political radar as we kind of approach this important general election. So coming to this event, um, I walked past Parliament Square, and as many of you will know, 15 years ago, uh, just over 15 years ago, many of us would have been sitting on Parliament Square um, in the final months of the conflict in Sri Lanka as the mass killings were going on, um, trying to get international attention and trying to get a ceasefire. So that didn't entirely work out. But those protests did have an effect. They put the Tamil question onto the international, onto the British political agenda. Um, and the work of the past 15 years amongst community members, amongst activists, and with the support of parliamentarians across both parties, across all parties, actually, we are at this point today when we have achieved much. So this event is to make sure that Ongoing for the next 15 years, and particularly in the next parliament also, the Tamil issue remains on the agenda of all the political parties, and that we continue to have cross-party support um, for our concerns. And so, what I hope is that the conversation that we have here today will take the Tamil struggle forward. Um, and that struggle is to secure a just and inclusive peace with accountability in Sri Lanka. This is not the peace that we have now, the peace that is built on denial and that is built on militarization and that is built on oppression and that is not sustainable eventually in the long term. But I hope that this conversation that we have here today will give us the momentum to take this struggle forward into the next parliament, into the next decades, um, to ensure that we secure that peace. So I'm going to stop there and then hand over to Dr. Kusi Anandakumar, who is um, the editor of the Tom Guardian. Um, and um, the event is being hosted by the Tom Guardian and the British Tom Association. And he will um, ask our party representatives to come up in turn and to give, to give us their views on how we can go forward from here. So thank you all very much for coming and I look forward to this event.